in third place of the top three things that annoy me. When you're telling a story and you're so psyched and pumped and you think it's the best story ever and as you get towards the climax, suddenly somebody finishes your sentence. <laughs> What are you doing? Yeah, so anyways, I see her reversing her car and then all of a sudden, all I hear is BANG! She reverses into the car behind her. Yeah, that, that's what I was about to say. Then it started to rain and you could hear the lightning coming from everywhere. Uh-huh. Then, out of the blue, suddenly, the, the lightning strikes a tree in front of you and the branch falls over and smashes into the ground, missing you by an inch. Damn it! But yeah, that, that's my story. <laughs> Another thing that really annoys me it's when you're talking to somebody and you're giving them full eye contact and I mean you're really staring at them and you're really telling them something deep something meaningful and you really want them to listen and you want them to hear what you're saying and you are not moving your eye from theirs when suddenly you notice they're looking elsewhere not elsewhere around behind you. They're looking at your face, but not your eyes. They're giving you the look of judgment. It's where they scan top to bottom and they spot a flaw and they start talking about it in their head. And they're not listening to what you're saying. No, 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 no. They're judging you. Yeah, and I was like, why would you want me to stay back? Like, do you think I earn enough money to stay back? It's like, you don't want to give me any overtime, you know? And it's like, as it is, as if I'm going to do that. I don't get paid enough already as it is. Blah, 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 person that will always have the exact same story as yours, only way better. So, I decided enough was enough. So I just stood up in the middle of class and I just walked on home. <laughs> How bad am I, man? <laughs> wow, you know, that reminds me of the time where I did the exact same thing at school. I remember. I stood up, I left the class, right in the middle, right in the middle, and as I walked away, <laughs> I lit the school on fire, sirens went crazy man, <laughs> oh wow, Whoa, those were fun times, serious? Oh, I remember it was what, a few months ago, I had a car accident that looked so bad, but I walked away unharmed. 
you know, felt pretty lucky that day. Just a little lucky. And, <laughs> you know what? That actually reminds me. I once had a car accident a few months ago as well, but this one was terrible, man. I flew through the windscreen and I was impaled on a fence right through my stomach. It wasn't until that I smeared myself out. I walked to my best friend's house to play PlayStation 3. <laughs> yeah, man. How badass am I? Fire out. Fuck my life. <laughs> lucky. Pretty lucky, huh?